851, turn right, heading 180. Hey everyone, welcome to DJ's Aviation. Before I begin, a huge thanks must go out to all the newcomers to the channel. We've been growing at a rate of 1,000 subscribers a day and are now literally within touching distance of 100,000 subscribers. So if you haven't subscribed already, please feel free to hit that button as we close in on the big 100k. In recent weeks, the cargo growth, while being always noticeable, has certainly been more prominent with airlines ordering new aircraft, and the future itself being discussed heavily on the YouTube channel. In the past day, the A330 freighter section was given a boost with Egypt Air Cargo, taking delivery of the first A330-200 to be converted from passenger to freighter configuration. An option we are now seeing become far more popular, with the likes of Boeing doing this similar change in configuration with their Boeing 737-800 aircraft. This particular aircraft in question though completed flight tests throughout the month of June according to a German specialist. While the aircraft was granted its type certificates in July. This isn't the first A330 converted freighter, but it is the first A330-200 specifically. DHL late last year received the first A330-300 conversion freighter after a joint venture was signed for the P2F programmed for the A330 by ST Engineering and Aerospace and, of course, Airbus. Interestingly enough, this aircraft is MSN 600, which just so happened to have been operating with Egypt Air as a passenger aircraft before it ceased operations in 2017 to, of course, become this new freighter aircraft. The move by Airbus to launch this P2F comes at the perfect time as the A330s reach the age where they can be successfully converted to freighter aircraft potentially meaning the need for an A330neo isn't high at this point. In saying that, they still could certainly be analysing the potential of it in the future. The two companies said, The timely redelivery of MSN 600 is a result of excellent spirit of cooperation between the partners EFW, ST Engineering Aerospace and Airbus, and their remarkable support by EASA, launch customer Egypt Air and the ECAA, to date, Egypt Air Cargo has firm orders for three A330-200 P2Fs. This aircraft can carry up to 61 metric tons of payload on flights of up to 3,900 nautical miles, while still offering a number of significant positions to fit the cargo. I'd like to thank you very much for watching this video of mine and of course the continued support. I do look forward to you all joining me in the next one. And we'll fly